Sikbingele le mbugeli wa siya Viva TV1 Wakubingele layo andile hu MC Polo Basi wa kwa ngobo Indabini za siya Viva TV1 Utabe sikfule la ngalo ngale siskati luti Umnumzane Julius Malema Umunga melwe kembu Economic Freedom Fighters Uisho gozali kandu kungi zwe mtunu Iskwili sabuya no mkwezeli Utaba esigulo luti Ungi zwe usekipe ama vundululu Atandu kubama ningi Ati Enzege mande kulume nkulumo yake Guzo kumblega gebo nagala mtimbini ya shuga shugene Na semtlanganweni ya shuga shugene Ye EFF Ukomba ngenjo mbane Munga melu ekembu umnomzane Julius Malem Ute minye ye mshangano ya ibizwe uye ngentro So yogu tufisa ugumnigeza iskunda So guba undu na ngulu wesfundazwe saga zulu natali Mlalilu wesi ya Viva TV1 Zizwele oga makingwa naga kuki ungizu mlandu waga mkunu Ez paulela ngalulu utaba Ela apaya kwa maye maye Giti Julius Malem Giti selo Julius Malem so takas are cool with ladies and the same as Africa, as Africa and Ghana. Utabang Tinkunzi, Uwe, Utabang Wuti, Ege Uena Lizwe, Joba, and Nuhambu Santos, Oki, Eko, Tilezi, Ege, they can do it, other people. But me, I can never allow this country and this continent to have a political court like you. You are a political devil, you are not a political court. As your colleagues and your um, organization portrayed to be. Never. Zia Kalamash. I'm going to ask who's on us. Imagine. 2021, Zia Kalamash. Tabugi Salapan. Uyo is a manufacturer. Kalapan. Ege Elapa. So it. Oh, don't ask. Oh, don't ask. Are you sure? Zia Kalamash. Employment. The Uta Batibati. Who never will have to change the beginning. Is that true? Yes, yes, sir. I want to set the record straight. That is my mom. That is my mom. No, she is not. I am not a machine. I am not a lawyer. 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 I Zote gimi fukela wun anansa in the tent of February is a pinna candidate of Kesepe. Because they respect the boom boom, they show the other star, the other Lokujana. Twana. Twana. Mwoge is Twana. Yeah. But this respect the boom boom, they go, we're not going to bring me any now. I want to talk about Natari. I want to pay that in my dinner, Uguti, in Wazi, Uguti, Gibabe, in South Africa. Hey, hey, my brother, hey, my brother. Once I got case at ten, it's done, it's done. What's also good? What's also good? Now they're excited in my life. My mother, 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 my so when there is a platform, we will learn. We will teach our people. We will teach our society. We will teach our people. We will teach our foundation. We will learn. 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 Bon, on va vous passer samedi. À ma propre conférence, à ma propre, 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 à
Kusenjalo munga meli wentlangani ya basali sanko umnomzane Richard Lope utagna mho liwe sanko ozo kangasela ikimbu eli ukripsko we la kukangaselwi ANC na no manga umupi umuholi o umuholi kwi sanko kyo fani la kondu kutiskunge spezul se sanko sizo status ngumonga ye uma enge kondi gase ingubo mkomo ye sanko our resolution national conference resolution says that leaders of sanko up to the level of branches street committees must campaign for the victory of the ANC. What we are going to do, comrades, we are going to meet as the NEC and take a serious decision. There is no leader from Sanko that will be allowed to pronounce the mushrooming political parties. Itembel piksa yeningi zima Afrika lo watubo vu oga played zimande umli lo shubo hang hang wez kujenzo kuma na na se intage neza shuga shuge ne wez politiki na se mparatini umnumza ne played zimande ungongo shewez mfundo utu yezo anje ngapa na ngapa watu agonke lo kasolo ngako yena agagwazi mbugelo siya viva tv one togo zela na inkulumo yalaba huli begnagisana ngamakama Indlanga no epegele ukusetjenzi swa kwema liaba koki ndela i auta. Iso le utogote la play it in zimande. Kanye no slalo we poti le NSFAS u NS Tkosa. Ngokufumba tiswa injo onjo huguze bavigele izingampane ishinze kwa angama tenda. Hatinda umnyangu wemfundi pageme. Lendlanga no iti ina abu pufagazi ibengulumo ekoshiwe efagazela loku. Ipaula ngalulu daba hiti e iti kumele akonju inzi la unzi mande. Kandige izo mvulela ita la lopu kibengu. Just last week, a series of leaked recordings released by the Organization on Doing Tax Abuse revealed the details of a criminal cartel operating inside the Department of Higher Education. We are preparing criminal charges against Nzimande, and we are also briefing our legal team to declare the NISFIS board delinquent. As Pendulela Nzimande, who's piggy le lezinzolo, what he is in Gamampunge. I therefore wish to dismiss this baseless insinuation by outer. Some organizations, including some sections of the media, that I as minister was involved in some form of corruption at NESFAS. These are all lies that emanate from a malicious fight back campaign. My conscience is clear and I have nothing to hide or fear. Uti lena yimza moyogu zilue la kwe zinye zinlangano, jongo bipoti le NSFAS lizo kalu kete zinye zinkontilega esebenze sana nazo. It is our view that the leaked so-called recordings are part of a nefarious fight back campaign that is meant to undermine and frustrate the decision of the NSFAS board. Kunzi mande upotule ngogoti uzo bizo mshangano putu mayone poti le NSFAS ngolwe sasu uzo punga ngalulu taba. Ushalo ka zolonke chigelele kwite mbuli ka kongolo se ANC. Uye ipi ka yo kuti sfundazo sa sempumalanga si sfundazo esupe ka yo. Guna loko uti sona sfundazo espete ingrenye entri ziyo yeningi zima Afrika. Wabalula izinde itinda ukeese amalase ukuti ase zindini sa sempumalanga. Ganti futi aisti ngo eskulu ezo enlase nengi zima Afrika. Alakitina ngalapo upinde watinda utabala loyo 
no pala chigelele we pembu i ANC umnumza ne figile mbalula ukwete mantashe utie maipenduliz datel kwa bona gala njege uguti na elendo yindo emshia no ngaba zane no wetuga eskabenso uguti umholi onjengo figile mbalula enga ikulu maganjani indo enjenga lena koda ubese peta nguguti umholi nano mayumupi umesanda ungene iskundini kwe kigelele uguti afundu kuluma ebala ama kamake nano kutige uma esadwe ni oseli guso no maistatu los kogile zinga kagile nganigase kuye kvele kutu ya temba futu nekolo lo kuti umnomza nefigile mbalula uzo kula esadwe na nigezwe so na ngoba uinzizwa ekonzi lo kuluma I'm going to bring in the national chairperson of the ANC Mr. Samson Kwede Mandashe you said that uh... There are rebel movements all across Africa being led by former presidents. Is your former president leading a rebel movement? No, no. I'm talking of, of probabilities and possibilities in the continent of Africa. That when uh, presidents don't want to give away power, half the time they ultimately come up into rebel movements. I was telling somebody yesterday that Savin became of a, of a movement that was regarded as revolutionary at a point, but he wanted power. Uh, Bozis in Central African Republic is leading a rebel movement. Lagama is from Frelimo, is leading a rebel movement. It's, it's normal in the continent when you want power, you want to retain it forever. You will open a rebel movement. All we must watch, it must not be armed. That's all. So in essence, you are diagnosing and your analysis at this point in time of the party that has now been joined or formed by your former leader, whom you led with as Secretary General for over over a decade, is a rebel movement. Yes. Now, you see, that president led me for 10 years. I was his Secretary General. He never told me that that ANC was his ANC. Now, when you talk of, of Ramaphosa's ANC today, he's teaching me something new. I will have to unlearn what he taught me and learn the new. Uh, So if uh, the President Zuma led the ANC for two terms without contest, he must appreciate that now time is for the next leader. Actually, it's close to a leader after Ramaphosa. So he must just accept that it will move on. And that talks to an issue that I raised with members of the ANC. The ANC must deal with its own transition, that there will be older leaders, there will be older leaders who are going to be fewer and fewer. Younger leaders must fuse in. That is what we call generational mix, and we must manage that carefully and not uh, explain it to inflict pain on us. When you look at the community of Mpumalanga moving away from MK, there's a lot of poverty within the specific province. There's a lot of issues pertaining to development of the areas. Some roads are infected with potholes due to the trucks traveling in the coal belt of this specific area. What are some of the issues that you as the African National Congress would be bringing in resolving some of the societal issues facing these people of Mpumalang? Prevalence of, of potholes in Mpumalanga is not a reflection of poverty. It's a reflection of a problem which is the heartland for energy for the country. Coal is mine here. Yeah. Electricity is generated here. It's actually of the 14 power stations that are run, 12 are in Pumalanga. And therefore, that is not a sign of poverty. That is the sign of a heartland of generating energy for the country, not only for the province. So, Pumalanga, we must attend to its problems because it has the capacity. But if we are entertaining a debate that says close coal mines, close power stations. I can tell you that we're then planting a seed for poverty. National Chair, and I'll also bring you, Mr. Nlovu. On the issue of power stations, you've been very vocal in saying that you cannot co- close coal mines. Can we just give a diagnosis of what has happened with Komati Power Station and how that specific community has been affected by the closure of that power station? Let me do that for you. Uh, I'm a Minister of Energy. Yeah. I can do that <laughs> for you better. Yeah. You see, Komadi was closed prematurely. Mm. Okay. It's, a, it's, a, it's an energy transition, but it's not just. In the sense that it was closed when it was generating a number of megawatts and employing a number of people. The number of people employed is much fewer. The megawatts generated is much less. So that can't be just. 
So there is a transition that is not just. So it's an example of how we should not do transitioning in energy. Commodity is one example that we must learn. It is not a just transition. It is bad example of transitioning. Have you invited your former deputy president out in Barberton to join you this weekend? I don't understand why everybody is interested whether Comrade Mabuza is going to attend this big event or not. We must know that Mabuza is a member of the ANC and as the former president, deputy president of the ANC is going to be invited uh, to that event. So we are not sure whether he will attend or not, but he's going to be invited. If he will have time, then he is going to attend as a member of the African National Congress. All of us, we are going to the stadium. And Comrade Mabuza, if he will have time, he is also going to be part of this massive celebration of the birth of the African National Congress. National Chair, last one to you. Have you spoken with your Secretary General Figilam Balula? with those revelations he made about the fire pool, about Nkandla and former President Jacob Zuma, which some have perceived as him decampaigning his own party. I don't know if um, uh, th- those were revelations. I think I, I, I listened very carefully to what he said as Secretary General. He's my Secretary General. I thought he was carried away by yourself, guys. <laughs> uh, he saw your cameras, he got taken away, <laughs> and he said things he should not have said. Uh, to me, uh, it's an issue that we will have to deal with it internally, that when you lead, you count every word you say. If you don't, you catch fire. And, and, and I think it's something that you learn in the trade. As you grow in the trade, you understand that better. You can say things that uh, you are saying without being excited but say things and explain things very well. For example, let me give you an example. He talked about a water pool, a fire pool. And I reminded comrades that we went to Nkandla, we saw that swimming pool. We came out, ambushed us and asked, what did you see? We told journalists, this is a swimming pool, but because there's a lot of water, in case of fire, it can be used as a fire pool. We closed the case. Because it's a swimming pool with a lot of water. In case of fire, you can use that water <laughs> as a fire pool. So that closed the case. I don't know why do you reopen that today. I can't understand it. But are you not worried that he? it's becoming a trend with your Secretary General for him just to blurt out things, not have speaking notes? When he goes to manifesto reviews, he doesn't speak about what you've done in government, but he speaks about internal dynamics and people's names. For instance, what he spoke about in KwaZulu-Natal in the manifesto review. I know that growing into a role is a painful process. And I am a great believer that you allow companies to grow into roles. If you rush them into roles, you are going to make them commit a lot of mistakes and mistake, a mistake, uh, 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 some girl, is like, uh, is, is like a, 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 a stranger you meet in your journey to success. You know, failure is a stranger you meet in your journey to success. And every time you come across a failure, don't despair, don't give up. Appreciate that you have met this, this uh, stranger, you're on your way to success. That's the same thing in playing roles. Uh, I love a Secretary General who likes talking because that means he will grow faster into the role of a Secretary General uh, because he talks, he engages with issues. If you commit mistakes in that process, it's not the end of the story. Are you going to expel Jacob Zuma from the party? He's not expelled, he has walked away. You don't, Are you go- <laughs> no, you don't expel a person who has walked away. There's no need to expel him, he has walked away. Are you not going to take him to a DC? There's no need, he has walked away. So simply you're ignoring him, you're blue-ticking him? He is, he has walked away. So <laughs> what, what action do you take to a person who has talked away, walked away? He has walked away. Yeah. Thank you very much, Mr. Mantashi. You can't do anything with the person who works away. <laughs>
that is the Hachlacha <laughs> person off of the ANC. So actually saying, Jacob Zuma has walked away. There's nothing you can do with a person who's walked away. And speaking about having to unlearn some of the things he learned from Zuma for the past decade, that former President Zuma at the helm of the ANC. And also speaking about the Secretary General saying that he should have not mentioned the issues of the fire pool of Finkanda because he's reopening a debate that they closed when they visited the former president's home in Nkandla after that investigation by the public protector.